We've not got enough money to bring anybody in. Oh, nobody wants our players. The transfer window's in the bin. So we're going to play Birmingham instead. What a treat. And welcome back to the Spurs Save with me and I spend Jeff M. Good to see you, everyone. Hope you're well. Today we're gonna to play Stoke and Birmingham. What a what a treat. You can, they're connect, connected by a motorway, so they're very, very easy to get to. Um not really living Tottenham though, to be fair. <sighs> yeah, it's gonna be quite a commute. We'll have to just stay at a Premier Inn somewhere on that road. Uh, but since we last met, things have gone quite well. It was that 3-0 victory over Crystal Palace, that convincing 3-0 victory. Uh, we then played away at the Etihad and uh, Manchester City are just better than we are. Harry Kane scored, but a growing and sterling early goals, and they just took their foot off the gas. We couldn't break them down, nothing could be done. Uh, 2 1 defeat there. But since then, not lost to game viewers. Uh, Watford beat them 3-2 and 3-1. The 3-2 was particularly enjoyable because um, we went, what, what was it, 1-0 down? Yeah, then back to 2-1 down and then all of a sudden Son came in, late doors, 82nd minute, pops up with a winner. Didn't think we were going to win it. Did, only thought we were going to get a point in fact actually but uh, yeah, to, to win that game was huge and then to beat them 3-1 in the game after that, straight away playing Watford pat to back for whatever reason. Uh, perfect. Then Mansfield came along. Tricky Mansfield, that's right. Um, we scored after two minutes, they scored after seven. CJ Hamilton scored a banger from the edge of the box and then we couldn't score again. I was giving all of these players as much much opportunity to, to shine. Didn't make a single sub. Didn't want to risk any of these other boys. Um, yeah, we just we just couldn't break them down. I was thinking, surely it's going to happen. Surely it's going to happen. Just didn't happen. Uh, we beat them in the replay though. Only one nil. Mansfield, a team to look out for, viewers. Uh, and also Southampton and Everton both beaten uh, with us scoring three goals. Clean sheets. Not something we do very often. And we're going to focus this season, especially on our FA Cup run. We've got Barcelona in the Champions League. We might as well just bin that off. Uh, the league right now, not looking pretty pretty, pretty good, is it? And uh, Birmingham, I mean, they're a side that we should be beating. The, the Cup run begins now. But first things first, let's play Stoke and, uh, yeah, get some points on the board. The league table's interesting. We are level on points with Arsenal. We are three ahead of Chelsea, uh, but we do have a game in hand. So if we win that game, we go level with United. And if we win by a decent margin against Stoke, maybe we'll be up there. Uh, United played Chelsea this weekend, big game in the, in the race for the top four um, so we should be okay we're, we're currently what 10 points off the top with a game in hand could be seven if you win today everyone else plays though so it's technically not right but you, you get what I'm saying team wise for this one then Lloris will be in goal De Lorenzo and Diallo have got partnerships with Chiesa and Son Heung-min look at everybody getting on Laporte and Sanchez their mates we've got Winks and Ndombele their mates and Ali and Kane their friends so much friendship in this series everyone's getting on tremendously well and I'm, I'm on board with it 100% they're playing 4-4-2 Stoke playing a 4-4-2 take, take me back to 2009 come on lads we should be winning this one no, no trouble at all Just let's just get it shall we come on then here we go as uh and Laporte's been playing well. Yeah, he's in very good form. Di Lorenzo's like a Swiss army knife of a player. I mean, we're picking everybody up. Really, this is just the tune-up game for the massive game we've got against Birmingham in the FA Cup viewers. This is... This, is, this doesn't really matter to me. It, do, it does. I would, I'd like to get in the Champions League again. Just to, just to, and what I'm worried about, viewers, and, and tell me if I'm wrong here, I'm worried that we might be just doing this save all year until we win something. I think the series should definitely continue until I win a trophy. I don't care what the trophy is in terms of actually Tottenham winning it. I think we should do that just to prove that, you know, I'm, I'm better than Pochettino. That's all we're trying to prove, really, as Kent shoots wide. So uh, this series could carry... I don't know. There's no natural end to this, really, because Spurs don't win trophies, and I I'm saying I'm going to carry on until we win a trophy. We could be here forever, viewers. Which, what if we're doing this in FM 2022? That's going to be a problem as they go very close and we just about get it away. Stoke looking dangerous. We should, if, we, if you look at the crime rates, that's pretty accurate. Probably Stoke. I don't know. I've, I've guessed there. If you're from Stoke, sorry about that. It's a corner. Chiesa whips it in and uh, Kane's there. It's a chance, I guess. It's been quite a boring half, hasn't it? Not much has happened at all. Got a lot of games in this January period, though. Too many games, if you ask me. Stoke in 15th. We should be doing better, though. At half-time, more possession, more shots, but no more goals. I certainly say. Um, we've been the better team here. Just keep doing what you're doing. You'll be fine. Not exactly what you're doing, because we'll just, we'll draw nil nil. All right, come on, come on, boys. The, the, the Birmingham game. Think about the Birmingham game, in which a lot of you will probably be rested. Although I do care about it, viewers. That that is that seems hypocritical now. Leeds racing down that left hand side. Ball put in, and Lloris there. What a catch! I mean, I hope our fans are applauding that. They've come all this way. As um yeah, I mean, I said so. What these boys as well? Looking forward to the Premier Inn. I tell you, the, some Premier Inns I've been to are top notch. I will say the one near Heathrow Airport, actually near um near the near the car parks is. Harry Kane has got the ball and nearly scored. Sorry, but they I do recommend it. If you're if you're travelling 
anywhere and you want to go to he- the Heathrow Airport Premier Inn, it's fantastic. And if it, for anyone from Premier Inn's watching, I will have a complimentary room. Thank you. From Premier Inn to Premier League, as uh, they nearly score again here. Eh? I've also been to some dreadful, dreadful Premier Inns. Um, but pff, that was probably a one off Premier Inn. So. Don't you worry about it. We've got the ball. Diallo on this left-hand side. He's become sort of a very good left-back for me as he loses the ball running forward. And now Ngoy, well, he's turned his man there quite comfortably. He's racing it on goal and he's just knocked it past. He's scored one of the best goals in world football, viewers. That's what he's done. We'll look at it again. He sends... Is that Laporte who's had a fantastic time? It is. He sends Laporte into a different dimension. I mean, off he goes, look. And there Ngoy goes, just racing forward, sprinting forward at pace. Those legs look long. And then Lloris is like, oh, you're very close. He's getting closer. He's getting closer. He's getting He's gone right. He's oh, scored. I mean, we might have to make a change here. Half an hour to go. This is not particularly good, is it, viewers? Madison's going to come on. And Dombele apparently disenchanted. That's very... I mean, let's go, champ. Get him on. And Haaland's going to come on for Kane. Three changes as they're through again. And Lloris makes a save. What's happening? This was supposed to be where we put the marker down. We're a top 14. Absolutely. But instead, we're losing away at Stoke. Which no, no one wanted this, did they? As they go close again, Lloris just about gets it away. A bit fortunate as they hit the post. Let's go attacking. Let's, 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 hit, let's go for them. Got a corner. It's whipped towards that middle of the area. And... And, um, well, we're all at sea here, viewers. Oh, starboard. Oh. Oh, no. I forgot what it's called. Monopoly board. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I guessed. I don't know. I don't, <laughs> if I didn't guess, I know it's not Monopoly board. I made one up. There's five minutes to go here, gang. We'll go very attacking. We'll work it into the box for the final few moments. Stop shooting on sight. Let's just create one opportunity. They're racing forward. And go again. He's... he's Doing all sorts of bother, isn't he? Lays it back. They, they, they're on for another goal here if we're not careful. That will seal it as well if they do get that goal. They take us on. Ball played back. It's cleared away. No, it's not. Lee Lee scored. No, no, sorry. Lee Yang Sung scored. And, um, well, the, the Stoke fans, the ones singing. So, well, they're finished. They have sung. <laughs> Good. It's not good. We're two 0 down. We've lost two 0 to Stoke viewers. I've been in the, I've been in a little bit of a blur here. I've, I feel like I'm, I'm not. I feel like I'm having an out of body experience. As it's popped in. And we're just going to lose, are we? We've been on a tremendous run. We've only lost to City and now Stoke. So, mark that up. Very even game. Just not taking our chances. But we should probably stop shooting on sight, everyone. If only someone had commented that, saying, stop shooting on sight. Try and, try and create more. Mm. Yeah, some of you have said that, to be fair. We'll work it into the box instead then. All right, everyone? Happy now? Don't run at the defence either so much. Let's just everyone calm down. Now, in four days, now look, the league game, sure, we care about the league. But we're trying to say, we're trying to win something here. Birmingham coming up. It, it's set to be quite the adventure. Now, of course, we're in a transfer window right now. And I did say today would be a transfer bonanza. But as I touched on on the intro, we've not even got any money. To spend. We've got 20 million. And it's not enough. It's not enough to, to improve our team anywhere near enough to the levels of actually achieving something. So... It's not great, is it? Like, sure, I could bring in some comedy signings, like, I don't know, Phil... No, 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 not him. That was a serious signing. That was a good signing. Oh, no, apparently he's, he's sick of my bullshit. He's got a virus. Um, I mean, go to the doctor. Imagine being genuinely ill and then I turn up. Dr. Benji turns up. Hello, hello, Phil! Oh, God, oh, God. Oh, he's fainted. Why has he fainted? Team selection advice for the upcoming game against uh, against Birmingham. Oh, we'll go for it. Oh, yeah, sure. Jesus Perez's suggested squad. We'll, we'll see what he's got. We'll see what he's bringing to the table. You know, something that's key about football manager is he's have good staff viewers. That's a, it's a key point. So sure, yeah, all right, whatever. Meanwhile, Watford are trying to steal my um my star my star regen that came through, and we've just gone. Yeah, have him if you want him. No, no, no. That's not that's not how it's working. Offer him whatever contract he wants. Keep him lo lock and key here. Oh, we get 1.4 million in compensation. Not enough. Dear me. Who's in charge of that? Not me, obviously. Right, let the assistants pick this team, viewers. So if it loses. I am not really responsible. I'm actually going to change. It. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to put Holland up front for Kane. That's the one switch we're going to make. The rest of the team. There's a few players lacking match fitness, but this is the priority here. Win the FA Cup. They're playing a four-one-four-one system, and now because we're trying to work it into the box, at some point we'll pick them apart. We should be winning this one fairly comfortably. And then let's aggressively say, I want a solid effort. I want. I don't want them to. And they need to know. Okay, we're not taking this one lightly. This is a win at all costs game. Here we go then. Tottenham, Birmingham. It's it's the it's the, the capital city, London versus the second city or third. I don't know what comes after Liverpool. See, some of you are thinking, oh, he means Manchester, and then I sort of flips it on its head. Reading a beat Manchester. They're beating Manchester City. Oh, not, I don't. I can do without a day of upsets. Thank you very much. We'll go attacking as well. Let's let's not be let's not be culpable for that as. Well, there was a flash there, but no goal. Something happened for you. If, if Manchester City could be knocked out, they've scored. Fernandinho's bagged one. I was thinking if they could be knocked out, that makes our route, our route to the final much easier. This is going very similar. You didn't see it, viewers. I, I talked about it pre-game, though. 
This makes, oh, and in, Goy's injured, by the way, for Stoke. Of course he is. Too late now. He scored a great goal against me, by the way. He's he scored a lot this season. I'm gonna, I'm gonna punch someone's face in. But this is like the Mansfield game where we were comfortably the better side, and they just pre pre prevented us from doing anything. I'm not happy with the performance. You've got to give it to them. You've got to go, oi, you lot, not happy with the performance. I probably wouldn't say it with that much sass, but um, I'd probably go, um, everybody, I'd, welcome to Birmingham. I wouldn't say that like that either. We're not even in Birmingham, and I said about the, I said we'd stay out of Premier Inn. So at the moment we're staying in Cambridge, which is not beneficial to any. Anyone. Who's in charge of where we stay? Am I supposed to be in charge? No, no, not you. I'm not again. When I say that, I'm not always talking to you. Okay, it's not all about you. Yeah, you look just just let me get on with this. Wait, don't look at me then. I said, let me get on with this. Dear me, some the cheek of some people. Harry drinks uh, in the midfield there. Finds and Dombele gets it back. Lovely ball up wise to Chiesa if he can get it into the center. He can. Hans there. Surely. Oh, what the dickens? Joanna Lumley with a save and Deli Ali gets a winter winter throw in, which is not he's not one a throw in. It's just a throw in. Imagine getting that in a ruffle. You've got a throw in in the 56th minute. You'd be annoyed. You could, you've got a receipt for this. I don't want this. Giving it to friends for Christmas. I've got a throw in. Why has he gifted me a throw in? Referee, there's been an incident. There's been an incident. Second yellow card. He's off. He's gone. Anderson Emmanuel, 64 minutes in. He's just been booked. Oh, dear me. What a fool. Why is he wearing a baseball cap in his picture? Hold on a second there. He can't. You can't. <laughs> you can't wear an hat. I mean, it looks like it's a smashing hat. But you can't wear a hat in the picture. There's no rules anymore. Imagine that on Sky Sports. You just like, you just see somebody in full kit but they're wearing flip-flops. It's bad nonsense. Ten minutes left to go. Harry Kane's going to come on. He probably should have started, viewers. We've made a mistake there. Uh, Deli Ali's going to come into the centre. Son's going to go out to the left. We've, we've got all the, the big guns out there. We should really score by now. Oh, let's, let's go, champ. Let's get him on. I could do without a replay, by the way. We're trying to progress here in the FA Cup. Oh, viewers, the time's ticking. The time, the time. We're three minutes to go. We're playing so many matches. We've got two legs as well against bloody Barcelona. And now I've got to play a replay. Against, oh, what is, look at this. Look at it. Look at all of this. Me putting my hand there doesn't really work when I've got a mouse. Look at that! Why am I talking like that? Nil nil. Nil nil. What an episode this has been. Lost two nils to Stoke and drew to Birmingham. Wow. Tottenham draw against 10 man Birmingham. I mean, I just said that, Terry. And also, why is Terry Dickens, this doesn't make any sense, why is the press officer forwarding me an email from Football365? Why is no one questioning this? I was there! I, I was, they were, the fans were giving me abuse. I don't need this, really. The Tottenham Hotspur players hurried off the pitch in a match that will go down. Well, they have to get the bus. I mean, it's not going to get itself the mega bus, is it? Ridiculous. We should have won. I mean, I don't know what I could have done differently. No highlights for you. Sorry for all of this. I feel like we're getting back to when you would like. Oh, God. Terrible. If you enjoyed today's episode, though, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. We love with care for the video tonight. It's time. Goodbye. What an episode that is, by the way. What an episode. Oh, that run gets harder. Birmingham, Chelsea. Jesus.